Greetings, boys and girls. I'm Jack Down from The Entertainment, and today we are here for another game within Fear Fest. Today we're playing a game called Song of Horror, and I feel like a title like that it fits right in with Fear Fest. I don't know. Once again, I don't re remember anything, anything about any of the games I'm playing during Fear Fest. I got them a long time ago. Forgot why I chose them. I don't remember what I read about this game that I thought sounded cool. One thing I will say is when I was doing the settings, uh, found that there were some interesting things in the difficulty. There's permanent death in this game, which may make sense for a horror game, but to me, I prefer not having something like that in a horror game, and instead rather actually have that in an RPG game. Either way, uh, it works, technically does work for what we're doing now, which is Fear Fest. Playing games between half an hour to 45 minutes, so uh, we'll see if I last that long even. And yeah, let's play. And by the way, I am doing the hardest difficulty, so we are doing... The one with permanent death, permanent death, and all the difficulties involved. When I do the normal, if I like this game and feel like doing an LP of it, um, I will do normal difficulty instead of the most difficult difficulty. Well then. Controller? No thanks. I don't like controllers. Especially not the Xbox kind. Too big. But I use headphones for everything, computer. Oh, that's um, close to my actual birthday. I'm not gonna say how close though. That's pretty close to how I looked. Except for nicer looking. Me being the one that's nicer looking. Home sweet home. And I definitely do not talk like that. I talk better. Whoa, strange. This is not... Whoa, what the hell? This just moves the head, but not the body. This is gonna be a very difficult game to play. This is very Silent Hill type. I think they call these tank controls. Holy shit, this is difficult. The horror of this game is trying to learn how to walk properly. Packed with random stuff. Yeah, well, this is how my room looks, except for worse. Historical fiction author. Nope, waiting to get my story published, hopefully this year. Although it supposedly takes up to six months, four to six months to... takes up to four to six months just to actually get the books published themselves. 80s music, good. But yeah, so four to six months, you know, even if I get my story edited by the end of this month, which I'm hoping for, that's like January or March by the time it's going to be fully published hmm really don't like games where you can't use the mouse to uh, move around I love moving cameras around looking at the environment yep guess so 
done with this room. Oh crikey, seriously. Ah, oh, are you serious game? I fucking hate games like that. Friday evening, and there's an emergency? This is serious business. Sebastian Husher is nowhere to be found, and his manuscript should have been at the office by Tuesday. He won't answer his calls, and he hasn't shown up at his office at the university. He's vanished into thin air. Oh, don't screw with me, Etienne. Call him on Monday, or send a courier for him. I, I just got in the door less than five minutes ago. I go myself, but I've got to attend Albert's performance in half an hour. Plus, Husher's house is closer to your place than it is to mine. Come on, man. The sooner you go, the sooner you'll get back home. Mm -hmm. You're going to owe me a big fat favor. Whatever you want. Write this down. 4 Abbott Thomas Road. In the old housing developments along Highway EB-15. EB-15? Good God, that's out in the sticks. I plan to take a few days off after this. Well, we'll talk about that once you find him. Oh. And if he gives you the manuscript, don't show it to anyone. And don't go selling it off to the highest bidder. I'll see what I can do. We'll ring you up when I get back. Thanks, Dan. You're saving my skin. Again. So we don't get to... Alright. So you just get to... Explore a few areas and that's it. This is a weird looking uh, cutscene, by the way. There's pictures. Stretch my complaints. Rising from my lot as a drunkard and financial ruin to that of an errand boy is actually quite an improvement. If only things had gone a bit better for the company. Or I'd got on the wagon a bit sooner. Mm -hmm. Damn, Sophie did the right thing when she divorced me. I would have divorced myself in her place. Man, you have a worse life than I do. Oh, actually, Annoying. not really, but... Bloody alcoholic. Shin up, you. That is Daniel Neuer, the bloody ex-alcoholic, after all. Wake publishes employee by day, wake publishes screwed over lackey by evening. Even Friday evenings. Kind of probably the same I could find shit life, but just my different, uh, quite different bit. stuff. After all, he is the publishing firm's biggest star. Let's cross our fingers and hope he's home. Yeah, sure. <sighs> so What a mansion. That pretty much qualifies as a small mansion. Do all horror games take place in a mansion? Or a school? Or a hospital slash asylum? Prelude. A Friday like any other. What's this? Did not know it either. I don't know because I like to explore. I come from an RPG background. Kind of, well, not really. Cool. Hello. Yeah. Is that music? Of course Let's it is. Take a look. 
Why do you need a flashlight in this house? It's not that dark. Okay. Is that someone playing a music box? Look like travel guides. Guessing we can't close the door. Hopefully nobody just comes randomly in. Got a bathroom in here. Even though I don't like controllers, I switch to the controller because it's a lot less noisy. <laughs> so I'm guessing we're not going to be exploring because he's going to be like, Oh, that's, we can't go up there. Mm -hmm. One game that had too much exploring and another game that has not enough. I'd put them in my place, they look awesome. Are you not gonna show me that? Why do the doors like not look like doors? I can't read that writing. Please find another person to for an ornament box. All right. Interesting. What the? How can there be a door there? Why do I always happen to go the right way first time around? Taken a step forward when I heard the door close behind me. Yep, when saw I that. turned around, the door wasn't there anymore. Oh, well, and that's that was left of it was a creepy. strange shadow on the wall. I searched, I despaired, and I screamed until my throat began to burn. Mm. The candles started to run out, as did the batteries in my torch. From within the most suffocating darkness. The hours went by until turning into days, mm. and I began to fall in and out of a restless sleep. Sounds fun. I would hear voices, sometimes right next to me, other times a few yards away. It seemed like they were coming from the other side of the wall. Hmm. Desperate cries, howling in horror. Ooh. Sometimes Worst of all, a vast, oppressive silence would fall, seeming to emanate from everywhere and nowhere all at once. There was nobody mm. there, just hallucinations, nightmares, black nothingness, and the song from that music box, trapped in this impossible place i wondered if i was going to die there huh obviously not because that's uh this is the game etienne do you have any news on daniel yet oh sophie 
No. We've been calling him at home all day, but there's no response. Do you know if he's got a mobile phone? No, I, I don't think so. And if he does, he doesn't tend to keep it on him. Oh, man. I think I should pass by the Husher place when I leave, just to see if they know anything. Husher the writer? Your client? Yeah. I sent Daniel over there on Friday, and I haven't heard from him since. What's the address? I'm going to stop by Daniel's place, and if I don't find him, I can go around and ask about him. The house on the outskirts of town, on Highway EB-15. Number four, Abbott Thomas Road. It's a big house. Okay. Big? I'm headed over. More like a uh, mansion. Him find him. Uh, of course. Same to you. All right. Well. <sighs> so we have like different people we can play as or something. She gets a candle. Links to the lines. Speed. Uh, I'm guessing six is the highest, so she has five speed, stealth, four strength, six serenity. And then he has a lighter, sales manager. His speed is five, then four, then six, then five. Candle. Ah, these are the housekeepers. Maybe uh, six isn't the highest, because he has eight. Ah, flashlight, proper light, and not a freaking like lantern or whatever the hell that others had. Six, six, five, three. Well, it started with this, so we might as well go with this character. What's the why stuff for nothing? Well. We'll start with this character. Might as well get the story. I don't know what the other people... How you'd play the other people. Guess you get to see their story, but... Hey, that's my thing. That's why I haven't been outside for like the past five or six months. She just does not care. What is this, an RPG where people just, you know, walk into people's houses? The door was open. Is there anybody home? Yep, books, books, books. Got a bathroom with a uh, looks like a uh, a mirror that kind of does seem to work. Uh 
Oh, picture. What's this picture? Never heard of it. I was hoping it would show the picture. Nothing. Can't look over there. Yeah, I want to ride a motorcycle one day. Ah, boiler functioning, upper panel, shut down, press the left button, central button for starting, and the right button for emptying. We're going to have to do something with this eventually. Cool times. Mm -mm. Mmm. It's over here. Old metal box. Huh. Cool. Let's go back. Anything else in this room? Two doors. Mm -hmm. Uh, locked. Interesting game so far. Not sure what to think. Oh. Let's look at the hat. I see that letter on the table. Why can't I get it again? And this is why you don't do these kinds of camera controls. Finally. A note from the... Okay. I left the, your key in the top drawer of your bureau in the library and children. Alrighty. So many books. Camera. I need a, I need one. I need a library like this to be quite honest. I probably have this much books. Dictionaries, yep, I have a few of those. I know, huh? That's how I would feel. <laughs> Be like, ah, books. <laughs> Lubricated, huh? <clears throat> All right. Ooh, book here. Weeks, probably. It doesn't look like a lot of books, but it would take you a lot of time to read them. Or at least a lot of time to go through them and see which ones you would want to read. Hmm. Uh -huh. huh. Wait, we can do light here? Okay. Cool. What is this? A plant. 
Like how she just says, uh-huh, that's what you're looking at. And a chest set. I want to I want a map. Like I have no idea where I'm at. This is an interesting camera angle. Huh. All right, we got matches. This is the way I came in with the other character. Ah, oh, and then I came over this way. Wait. What's that? Oh, great. Okay. We're going to have to hide from something. Well, I guess it's nice to know. Okay, so that leads us. I now get an idea of where we're at. Just getting the feel of uh, the place. There's something on the counter. Oh, that's cool. Ah, fruit. Cookbooks. A metal ring. All right. Hmm. All right. Let's. Thought the power was off. Hmm. Joined by the youngest son. All right. This game has permanent death, so we want to be careful around that. To our right. Uh -uh. Door is locked. So far there's been two, three locked doors. Huh. Serve cereals. Dog food. What's this? Oil can. Cool. So we have some matches. Now all we need for the fireplace is some wood. Oh boy. You better take a look before you go back out. All right. Was that? Yeah, just say it out loud. Seems like the coast is clear. Oh, so we do have a map. About damn time. I didn't hear anything in there. Ah, kitchen, dining room, living room, library, WC, whatever that is, garage.
I, I think this is the room where I was able to I'm gonna like start doing that for every door now <laughs> okay so this is the door over here where you can do some hiding wait can I look at that oh, okay Wait, did I see some shinies or is it just the light? I should take a look on this floor first. Uh you did. Alright, well that takes care of that. I guess we can't go up there. Well, let's go see if we can light this room. Not sure if that'd be safe to do. There's something over there. Oh, it's a statue. Did not notice that before. Yeah, so we do need to get wood. Um, oh. Did not see this here. And music and wine, okay. Wait, what can we use to uh what can we use? Oh, we could probably use the oil can to loosen up that one thing. here in the uh, library. Whoa, camera angles. <gasps> Master key. Looks like an old key. It was jammed it was in the jam drawer in the library. <laughs> Jammed. Was there jam all over it? <laughs> Funny. Haiku. Oh. Anything else? Nothing left. Okay. I thought I heard something out there, so I was going to listen, but uh, it doesn't give me the option. So, I'm going to assume that if anything happens in here, it's because the game wants it to. Should I answer? No. This is not your house. Good. They hung up. I'd rather not get into anyone's business. Exactly. Like I said, this is not your house. Surprised I was able to listen to this. I hear a very small tap. And by small, I mean by small amount. Uh -huh. Let's listen to it again. There's a like. A really slow tapping sound. So slow, it's kind of creepy. I don't know if that's the place I want to go to. I 
There's another locked door, so let's go get that one. Send master key, so I think that's just for everything. Damn. That's, uh... Okay, then. Has the same tapping, so maybe that's just the noise it makes. Yes. Uh, so we can hide in here if we need to. feels more like a mystery game instead of like a horror game like mystery horror it's an interesting mix I actually quite enjoy it so far I mean the camera angles are a little weird but you know it takes a little use getting used to I guess So since that little tapping is just a thing, I'm just going to go in here. Ah, uh, so this is the basement. No qualms about going down in the basement? Upstairs? Nope. But basement? That's alright. Jeez. That was loud. Okay, I'm not going to be able to read that. If you found this note, congratulations, you went so closely to solving the puzzle I prepared for you. I hope it keeps you entertained while I'm away. I'm in your favorite doll to save and change the combination. Thank you, I don't think this. The combination has follows the number of our street address, Saul's age, decade, the year the canvas hanging upstairs right next to the staircase. Okay. Well, we had to go upstairs, and I had to try to remember what the address was. Wine. Vases. A TV that's probably going to turn on. Empty wardrobe, probably a place to hide. Fuses messed up. That's not gonna work. Alright. Let's go over here now. Junk washer and junk. Okay. Uh. All right. Well, the basement was creepy. Sounded like somebody was running up behind her. A 
Okay, we can't go there. And this is another room where we can hide. I found only two places where our character can hide. Record player with Voldy. Well, Rick, uh, Voldy did uh, that song "Summer," and that's pretty cool. I'm more into Ludwig van Beethoven, not Chopin. Hopefully, that'll piss somebody off watching this. Tobacco. Ugh. Well, that was creepy. Yes. Saw another door yesterday as I was walking by the dining room. I suddenly heard the music from Daddy's music box. When I went in and I saw the door, I went running to tell Mommy, but when he came back, it was gone. She scolded me for making things up. It's not fair. I was telling the truth. There was an old door there. Different from the rest, it even had a key in the keyhole. If I see it again, I'll go inside and leave the door open. That way, Mummy will believe me. I saw the weird door that Julia saw. Julia said, the one that wasn't there before. Mommy was very angry and kept yelling at Julia. The door is scary. I will hide the key in the dollhouse. Or I will hide the five dolls too. Or, and, I don't know what that symbol is, or if it's a symbol. Wait, let's read. And, I'll bring them out. When Mommy and Julia forget about the door, one will be hungry, so her friend will make dinner for her. Another one will read while her mom makes a sh takes a shower. The ugly one will watch the door so nobody comes in. Is this a little puzzle as well? Also? Keys in the dollhouse. Dolls will be hidden. So one's gonna be in the kitchen, one's gonna be in in the library, and one will be at the door. I don't know. Oh, let's look at the blood. It looks like blood in his. But maybe it's not. Okay, so this is, um... This is really spooky, actually. I don't know why it's so spooky. Oh, is this where we have to hide? Daniel. Is that you? I've seen enough horror games. We need to hide. Something is trying to get in. Make sure the door and repeated, repeatedly press X. Once you feel strong enough, push and block the door. Press right trigger. Okay. Damn, you had to do that so many damn times. <laughs> yeah. Oh God! What the hell just happened? What was pushing that door? I guess she have to hold it now. That's weird. Before it was like a toggle.
Hmm. I didn't expect our character to last this long. Okay, so it is. Do need the oil? That's weird. That's not how you know that stuff works. Oh, that's right. The oil's for the other thing. So I don't know then. Maybe we can go upstairs. Uh, first, let's go in here. Maybe the dolls, the girls, that that the one girl hid actually is in some of these areas, or maybe she just has a dollhouse that she put them into. Who knows? <laughs> Well, if someone is, you're screwed. Cause I got, we've got no place to hide. Could take a sword with you, but I have a feeling that's not gonna work. Nice top hat over there. I need to get myself one. This room is like really weird because it feels like something keeps hitting it <laughs> but nothing's actually there <laughs> oh we can go up stairs now up scares <laughs> that's what I almost said painting didn't take it down long ago all right maybe that's the one painting that they were talking about yeah the streets are so calm but what is up with that lady that was there at the um, swing set I like how it was something that we saw, but she did not. That's an interesting touch. Mm -mm. I almost probably got her killed because... Oh, don't do... I... Yes? Image of Catherine... What is happening to that door? Do not look at this photo. Oh, well. D that would be a fun prank to play. Just like take a photograph and then you just like place it somewhere. And then they're like, oh, that's a nice photograph. And then they like turn it around and it says, do not look at this photograph. And you're like, why? <laughs> that's awesome. I'm just gonna assume like the small tappings mean nothing. Dishcloth, a dirty dishcloth, so we can use that to start the fire. Why is starting this fire so necessary though? I don't know why I'm spending so much time and effort doing that 
it doesn't even say to do that anywhere. I don't think it's ever told me to do that, but for some reason, that's just something I want to do. By the by, I'm not going into that one room that just randomly opened. Maybe I'll do that for the end. Well, that's pretty, uh, shut off. Wasn't able to, uh, listen up to this one. Oh, this is just outside. Wait, you don't want to pick it up? Oh, I'd love to be able to look out over the balcony. Wait, I have to put something into the battery? That's weird. Or do I just, uh, combine it with, this, mm -mm. like, I was thinking on putting it inside the box, tongs. Happy anniversary. So the tongs could be used to get like maybe a key underneath underneath something. It feels really nice out here. Like I can almost feel the chill in the air. Even though it's a September in the game. Well it's late September. Alright, let's go this way to her right. Good lord. Landscape. What's this? Standard garage door remote control. And a chair. Yeah, I bet. I like how the game just doesn't even say it in her voice. It's just like, hey, you know what? Just keep that in mind when you need to hide. Because you need to, probably gonna need to do it like pretty soon. Hide from what though? Some masks. So, that desk over there might have to hide in probably pretty soon. Um, study, balcony, WC. Basement. Cool. Wait. I don't think this will work, but... Mm -mm. That's what I was thinking. Um, the only other thing I can think of is this, but I don't think that makes sense either. I would say something like a magnet. Cause it looked like a lock, a key was broken off into the keyhole. 
Did I go into that? Oh, was that one door locked? Wait a second, crying person. I need to... I need to see if this one was locked. It was not. Crying girl, you'll have to wait. Is this a red room? Oh, a trap door. Okay. Guess not. Paint brushes. So this room has a trap door in it. That goes somewhere. That's interesting. I like how it shows gears for things. That you're going to need. August 10th, 1998. I want to save for that. I'll take it. Cool. This is Fear Fest. This isn't an LP. I'm not going to spend too much time reading stuff here. Alright, let's check out this. No, wait. Or we can just die. Or not. Okay, good. Nothing of interest, just a record player, a letter. I keep forgetting because it doesn't ha it doesn't pop up often enough, so I'm just I completely forget about it, which is probably what they wanted. Scaffold goes here. Elevation of the house, which I can't read. Although I think with the nodes, I can just do this and maybe, oh, it's only to show me that. Of course, I, of course I was able to read that part game. All right, so I hear nothing from here. Oh God. There's someone on the other side. Sounds like it, but when you listen here, it doesn't. Oh. I have to get in there. All right. I guess we're going to have to go into that door that just randomly opened for us. Oh, um, that was f what that master key was all for. Can't use it for anything else now. Interesting. Either we're going to have to... Yeah, something's up. I have no idea what that does. Hmm. Let's see how long I was recording and we might do a death scene here. 
I edit it down, it'll be a little under an hour, so this will be our death scene. Ah. Uh. Let's just see what it does, because I'm gonna end it here. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. Um, it doesn't really do much. I was hoping for a cooler death scene. Anyways, um, that's the end of that. That's all the time we have for her. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I probably will do an LP of this game later on. It seems pretty cool. So I hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, stick around tomorrow for another awesome game within Fear Fest 3. Love you all. Peace to you. And as always... Stay safe.